1972, I was 16, young, my father said, to be traveling with him on his diplomatic missions. When I was home and he was absent, I spent long hours doing my homework at the mahogany desk, abrasing the shelves that lined every wall. I came to see what made me pull down that yellowing book. But the smell of Asia rose from it, and my discovery of the papers of all personal letters caught my attention. I know I shouldn't examine my father's private paper or anyone. I was afraid. My dear and unfortunate successor, it is with regret that I imagine you, whoever you are, reading the account I must put down here. The regret is partly for myself, because I will surely be at least in trouble, maybe dead, or perhaps worse, if this is in your hands. When my father returned from his latest trip, I looked for an opportunity to ask him of the letters in the strange book. I waited for him to be free, for us to be alone, but he was very busy in those days. Because this city is where my story starts, I'll call it Ammonia. Thank <laughs> you.